In MMA news, the UFC 257 main event took MMA fans by storm, just like the high level of action and surprise brought by the co-main event, when Michael Chandler shocks fans when he knock out Dan Hooker in the first round. Conor McGregor and Dustin didn't fail their fans after a good fight. However it wasn't a good comeback for the Irishman, when he got knocked out by Dustin Poirier in round 2. Conor McGregor lost to Dustin Poirier via TKO, and after 6 years Dustin successfully took his revenge. Poirier attacked McGregor's leg to kick off round 2, while McGregor's punch accuracy continued to impress. Poirier took the shots well and stayed busy, and after stunning McGregor with a left hand against the fence, he unloaded with both hands, ultimately dropping the Irishman with a right hand. Another big right hand followed, and referee Herb Dean stepped in, stopping the fight at 2.32 at round 2. Before the fight Conor McGregor said in an interview that he will knock out Dustin Poirier in just 60 seconds. When I talk I speak fact. Oh, he heard him. I visualize a first round stoppage. Conor McGregor is for real. I like Dustin, I think he's a good fighter. He's even a great fighter, you know, but great is still levels below me. His confidence is compelling. I'll knock Dustin out inside 60 seconds. January 23rd, I'm gonna get my hand raised by any means necessary. Maybe he was so confident that he can do the same thing a year ago and underestimate his opponent, but what happened is, it was totally different cause he was the one who got knocked out. I think the moral lesson here is don't ever underestimate your opponent. Who do you think Dustin faced next? Michael Chandler or a rematch with Khabib, if he will return in the UFC? Just comment down below. Thank you and bye bye.